In this video, I'll show the changes for Overgrowth Alpha 164, which you can try if you've pre-ordered. This week I started working on knife combat. Knife slashes are unique in that they require very little force, so unlike the other attacks, they don't need built-in footwork to support them. This means that you can move around freely while cutting with the knife, and can even dodge attacks without stopping. On the other hand, slicing an enemy has no direct effect on their balance, so you can't use knife slashes to interrupt an attack. The weapon design in Overgrowth is intended to give each weapon simple but distinct mechanics, so that the game plays very differently depending on what weapons are in use. This agile slashing mechanic seems to support that goal so far, because it feels very different from unarmed combat. The results of knife slashes are also quite dramatic, so it should work well for distinguishing the different levels of violence in the game. I also added an editor feature so you can connect items to characters using alt-click so that they're pre-equipped when the level starts instead of just falling to the ground. For now, knife versus knife combat uses the same blocking mechanics as sword fighting, which will have to be changed soon since it doesn't make much sense. However, it still looks for some interesting fight scenes. There's a lot more work to do on the knives, such as stabs, disarms, sheathing, throwing, and hit reactions, but I'm pretty happy with the result so far. That's it for this week. If you'd like to pre-order and try the alpha for yourself, you can do that at wolfire.com slash pre-order. If you'd like to hear about development news as soon as it happens, you can follow me on Twitter at Wolfire. You can also check out the Overgrowth subreddit at reddit.com slash r slash overgrowth or by clicking the link in this video's description.